Turn these elevators down to 100% from 150, it's a lot easier now. <laughs> Here we go. I ordered a couple more of those HRB 5000s for this jet. Now I got four of those bad boys. Those clouds look fantastic today, don't they? Yeah. Still slightly nose heavy, but not bad. I got the pack all the way back, as far as it can go, so. The contrast is really good in the sky. Yeah. Just cruising around 40%. Let's check a landing approach here. Let's see. We're down this far landing. You can see it's floating down pretty nice. Heck yeah. Here are down. We're going to have a crosswind landing, unfortunately, but. Take it. That was a like, sort of a tailwind cross, like a shallow tailwind landing. But you know what, man, it's it's a lot better to flare now that I backed off the elevator. I don't know what I was thinking, maintaining it with 150% throw. That's why I needed gobs of expo. But we back down on that elevator now. And, yeah. But you can see I don't have a whole lot of movement. Like that's kind of a really cool back, but nice and gentle yeah thanks for filming brad uh the lovely e-flight twin 70 all stock su 30 and uh i'm digging it more and more i was thinking i was going to upgrade the power system guys but you know what i'm kind of happy with the way it is stock so i think i'll just leave it alone and just enjoy it thanks for tuning in guys brad Lufer on the camera deuces wild signing out peace